Summerfest banners being carried by Boy Scout Troop 288. And remember the theme, Thar Be Pirates. Let's thank the Scouts for also helping to clean up after our parade this year. Go Scouts! All right, guys. All right, we have our Polk County Sheriff's Mounted Posse. It's a volunteer organization. And remember, our posse works for the Sheriff's Department assisting with search and rescue large animals, uh, rescue and parking security. And here we have our famous Grungy Galleon, the 2010 Dallas Summerfest Mascot Prior Ship. Remember, take a moment and say hi to Captain Jolly Roger and his crew. This ship has been built by volunteer hours that started in April. We want to thank the Visual Media Center, OSU Federal, Oregon First Community, and the Pope family for having this be part of their front yard for several months now. And uh, But it's been lots of fun. And remember, afterwards, they'll be parked, and you can take a tour of the ship, get your picture taken for five bucks, and with all those famous pirate people. Bless you guys. Arr, all right. You are a pirate! Thank you, Nancy. There is a lot of pirates out there. It's awesome. Following us today, we have our ABS bears with our Danny and Jilly bear and family. Danny Hartman and his adorable chainsaw carved bears. He's a weekly vendor at the Polk County Bounty Market on Thursdays. Come down and see us right here downtown. And here we have the Pirates driving our mayor and his wife, Ann. Hey, Jim and Ann, thank you for being part of Dallas and doing such a great job. John and Lucille Schneider are our second-in-command Grand Marshals. John was born on November 17, 1909 in Chicago, Illinois. He is celebrating his 101st birthday this year. He served in World War II as a CV in the U.S. Navy. John met his wife Lucille while they attended Fort Hayes Teachers College in Kansas. They both retired and will soon celebrate their 60th wedding anniversary. Right. They moved to Dallas in 2004 to live closer to their adult children and we're glad they're here today. Our volunteers give countless hours in training in order to protect your home and mine and to take care of events in our community. They do a lot of volunteer work and they appreciate all the support from our community. Thank you to the Dallas Fire Department. sign for sure.
be there and we will come in full force. So we appreciate all you guys. So. by Sam and Sandy Archer in their 2004 Chrysler Sebring. Thank you. Thank you, Jim, for all you do. Here's our Gusto Brothers. Woohoo! Yippee Pirates. Okay, guys. Nice. <laughs> Gustos are back for their third year in a row for playing right after the parade at Summerfest. We're so excited. Wouldn't be Summerfest without Scotty Dog. Yay. He's here with from OSU Federal, your community credit union, which is a proud sponsor of this year's Summerfest for the seventh consecutive year. Creating financial solutions to make lives better with convenient hours, including Saturdays. Here's our own Dallas Public Library that's doing set sale for the library. If you haven't had a chance this summer to swing through, they've had great programs and they just they're down to one month of helping all of us be better readers. So thank you so much. All right. Make sure you stop by the library for their book sale today too. Got lots going on. Here comes Val Grice in her limited edition Dale Earnhardt number three car owned by Gordon Domes, driven by Valerie Grice today. Is it? There, there she is. I see her. She's a bit of a NASCAR fan and a bit of a Dale Earnhardt fan. And she's followed by Julie and Gerald Hewitt of Dallas driving their Dale Earnhardt Jr. number eight, limited edition. Washington Street Steakhouse right. and Pub celebrating 11 years of business in Dallas and we are so appreciative. Oh, they there serve. be that pirate gal over there. Oh, I see Debbie oh, in there. there. Okay, guys. They serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner seven days a week. They would like to thank Dallas for their loyal support and we would like to thank you for yours. Dallas area seniors are up next. They have received the second place float award this year. Activities for the Dallas area seniors are pinochle, bunko, bingo, and games once a month. They enjoy movies and popcorn, mystery trips, museum trips, and trips to Spirit Mountain. All right. For more information, check them out. They're in the back of the library. We love having our seniors here. There are. All right, guys. Seniors also have the opportunity right now because of the late Candy Tommen, uh, there is the opportunity for them to receive $25,000 in match funding. So if you want to help support the new Senior Center, make sure to donate your dollars to them. And here we have Dallas I Can, the Plunder, the Creative Children's Pirates are here with us. 
Dallas Inner Community Activity Network provides enriching and creative after school and community programs. Aboard the SS I Can is our young pirates ready to capture art, music, and science of all kinds. Remember to stop and see their winning artwork at the Art in the Park tomorrow. This is another ribbon winner here, second place for antique tractor and farm vehicle. They won because of a great color scheme and a body style with a nice job on the restoration. Sean McNoll driving his AC tractor. Larry Lester, you want another ribbon? Two ribbons this year. We love having Larry here. First place for an antique tractor and third place for an antique tractor. Folks, give Larry a hand. We love having his tractors come out. Yeah. Bruce Blair. Hi, Bruce. Bruce has a 1949 Fer Ferguson which is driven by Brian, and also there's a Ford 8N with a loader. It didn't make it, he said, but uh, it's still running, I bet, huh, Brian? All right. Mid Valley Dental Associates up next. They have their uh, business located just around the corner on Washington Street here. If you haven't right. stopped taking a look, thank you, sir. Oh, oh, hey. Thank you. <laughs> I love it. Now they're passed out candy, but remember, brush and floss, as they say. All right. Arr. I'm pretty sure they have a booth on the lawn this year, too, so make sure you stop by and see them. Take a look at what services they have to offer. Oh, she did love those things. All right. <laughs> Our Shriners. Who loves the Shriners? Give them a hand, right. kids. Four runner grades welcome us today in their little go kart. There are 22 hospitals in the United States, Canada, and Mexico, all with help from the Renegade drivers. They received third place miscellaneous vehicle this year. Thanks, guys. Bless you. Thanks. For all you do. Merle, Oba, Ron, and Greg, thank you for coming out. Thanks again, guys. And here we have our old Vanwell building supply. Oh, I mean, Lily Liver Glass, be he saw, boy, my gosh, be your sea dog addled or be he a sock alleyway. Then yo, yo, ho, make him walk on the plank. I, be local lumberyard can help. They got the planks for booty to spare and the RV timbers too. Shiver me timbers. I would like to personally thank Vanwell Building Supply, our 28 foot pirate ship. We could not have built it without all of our lumber coming directly from them. Here we have our very own, that's it, <laughs> West Valley Hospital. West Valley Hospital encourage you to treasure your health by staying safe this summer and getting your annual preventative checkups and your immunizations. West Valley Hospital is part of Salem Health and is our community's resource for quality health care that's close to home. And they've been serving Polk County community for more than 100 years. Thank you. All right. It's a nice looking ship. Guess what? They won first place ribbon for animals in the junior division. Thanks for being with us. Goodwill Industries is next, driving a cargo bus with some walkers. Goodwill's mission statement is to provide vocational opportunities to people with barriers to employment. The Dallas store employs people with developmental disabilities in a supported environment. Goodwill also helps people find jobs through their Job Connection program. Visit our Goodwill today. Your donations change lives. Look, up in the sky. No, not up in the sky. On the top of the van. It's Carpet Hero. Stronger than dirt. Able to clean carpets in a single bound. Faster than a speeding steam cleaner. Here to clean all your flat surfaces, tiled grout, carpets, sidewalks, and more. It's Carpet Hero. Here we have Dallas Church. He's got his old Chevy Pirate truck. I didn't know they had old Chevy Pirate trucks. And it's uh, the official uh, truck and trailer. It's a 1951 Chevrolet pickup Pirate themed truck with the Dallas Church families and youth. Hi guys, glad you could be with us. Hi, Josh. 
And here we have Refraction Studio, a local photo photography studio. Their goal is to make photography fun and affordable. Visit them on their website at www.refractionstudio.com and schedule your session today. Don's here again with the, his uh, 1990 300SL Red Roadster. He won this at Summerfest at a raffle in 2007. He's been back at Summerfest every year driving it through. We love having him here. And here we have our own Abby Grove, part of our community, who is Miss Portland this year. She's the current holder of the Miss Portland crown, and is, which is part of the Miss America organization. Abby's going to be graduating from OSU in a vocal, with vocal performance and opera degree. She placed top, in the top ten at the recent Miss Oregon competition. Coming up next is American Family Insurance, Shane Brown Agency. Shane is brand new in our community this year. He just opened his business in the plaza next to Burger King. He is an inferno level sponsor of Summerfest this year. He's got his truck looking like a tropical island with a treasure chest full of items representing Polk County, the real treasure. Thanks, Shane. Thank you, Shane. All right, guys. If you want to learn more about his business, come on downtown. Captive. Yes, okay. Thank you. Look at those kids. They've got something tight for the ship. Thank you. It's Mr. Dallas. Dallas. Who knows Rhino in this crowd? AKA Ryan Spencer, our 2010 Mr. Dallas winner. Arr! Ryan got involved with Dornbecker Week because he wanted to impact someone's life. Rhino's being escorted today by Dan Pearson in his red BMW. For almost five months, he dedicated his energy to raising as much money as possible for the hospital. Ryan brought in over $1,500 for Dornbecker. He made a difference and had fun doing it. We appreciate him. This looks like our Dallas FFA chapter. The chapter started in 1955. Now 55 years later, there are over 60 active members. FFA is a, a dynamic youth leadership organization that is part agriculture education programs nationwide. Gives me pleasure to introduce to you Miss Mary in Polk County, and her name is Amy Everly. Did I do okay? I know I'd make it up for it. <laughs> and she's being driven by Dick Johansson, part of our community. She's originally from Coos Bay. Amy's 22 years old, and she's a senior at Western Oregon University. Next up is Miss Marion Polk, outstanding teen, driven by Marion Baker. This is, let's see, this year's teen is Kayla Garrison. Kayla's 16-year-old junior, attending West Salem High School. Again, riding in the 2004 Mini Cooper, driven by Marion Baker. And we have a big salute to Craven Woods Insurance, who are celebrating their 100th anniversary this year. 100 years in Dallas. Yeah. There's a fourth generation insurance agency, which has been serving Dallas and Polk County since 1910. Insurance rates have you stressed? Contact Craven Woods out on Ellendale, and they'll give you a quote. You'll be glad you gave them a call. Fun dog and trainer. 
Canine Corral is a brand new doggy facility over 3,000 square feet, has heated floors and air conditioning for your dogs. They're located in Polk County where Highway 51 merges into Highway 22. Contact them for daycare, boarding, training classes, and private lessons. They have a trick dogs for party too. Oh, I think we're seeing some tricks. Right behind Brenda is uh, her 1990 Ford Mustang convertible. And it even probably says it has a for sale sign in it. Okay, so where is the cool coming from? I'm confused. It's nice that it's not 106 degrees out. Let's give a big salute to our American Legion and the VFW veterans. Thanks, Big salute guys. to these guys. Come I'm on, Brad. And these guys are from the Dallas area. Many are members of the Dallas American Legion Post 20 and Veterans of Foreign Wars Post 3203. Dwayne Thiessen is commander of the Legion and Dennis Miller is commander of the VFW. With World War II veteran John Braden and John Schneider, this year's Grand Mar Marshal, which is our oldest vet at 101. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Too. All right, you guys. Yay! I think that's Dr. Pesley on a motorcycle. Yes. <laughs> I thought I recognized him. Coming up next is the Ark of Polk County, your community organization that advocates and supports parties with disabilities. Avast! These mateys are setting sail to promote community participation for people with disabilities. Thank you for all you do. They are chamber members, so if you'd like more information about how to get involved in the ARC by volunteering or having someone you love who has a disability get involved in our community, make sure to look them up. I believe it could be the Electric Peddler Crew there. Hi there! Remember, the days when biking was fun, well, it can be it again with electric bikes. Pedal, throttle, or do both. Go 20 miles on a seven cent charge for, at 20 miles an hour. Give us a call, take a test ride, get your throttle on. Dancing Divas are following who? Directed by Christy Hill, a dancer for elementary and middle school age students. They received third place vote in the junior division and Show. They receive the trophy for junior right. division this yes. year. And right behind them are the citizens supporting our Dallas schools. Citizens Supporting Dallas Schools is a group that is working with the Dallas School District to help raise money to keep their music our music programs that will be cut due to budget cuts from the state. For $9.46 for every person in Dallas, we could fund this music program for our elementary schools. <laughs> Achievers next are youth with their animals. 4-H Achievers invites you to join them this year at the Polk County Fair from August 12 to 15. In addition to animal Thanks, projects, guys. they have presentations, educational displays, and so much more. They hope to see you there. Our pirate bounty bond, we wanted to make sure that we thank 4-H and all of the crew that has come out and helped with the market this year. We've had volunteers helping unload and load our vendors. Farms that come out sell their produce to you every Thursday from 3 to 7 on the lawn. Those kids have been volunteering and it's been a great help. All right. Next up is our Les Schwab service truck. Les Schwab crew of Dallas would like to say thank you, Dallas, for all of your patronage. Behind them is American Outdoors, Dallas' newest sporting goods stores. The big red building behind Walmart, specializing in high-end hunting and fishing supplies. Unbeatable customer service with competitive Thanks, pricing. The largest variety in town, chamber members, we appreciate their support. They also provide classes, many, many classes. There's too many here for me to list, so make sure you take a look at their website. Keep an eye on chamber website. Thanks, guys. Thank you. 
Thank you for your support. Judy, thank you. Evangelical Bible Church is up next. For every bad, there's a good, and this ship has gone. God love us. God loves everyone. which won them first place for musical group in the junior division. Congratulations to you guys. Thank you for being a part of our community. All right, Nancy, where's one of the best places in Dallas to live when you're ready to retire? Dallas Retirement Village. Or DRV. They won first place in the miscellaneous vehicle for adult division this year. Their booth on the lawn. I don't even know how many years they have been in space 41, but it's been at least 10. <laughs> the old goat. <laughs> Very cute. The old timber. Timer. Soggy bottom. Corey, oh, it's great. Nice, it's yeah. great. Yeah. <laughs> Bubbles are plenty. Polk County Historical Society is featuring a 1935 model Girlinger Saddle Straddle Carrier sponsored by the Polk County Museum. Driven by Orville Stepper, I see Orville up there, and Jerry Bennett, both retired employees of Caterpillar Tractor Company, formerly Tow Motor here in Dallas. Before that, it was Girlinger Carrier Company. Athena here won a ribbon. First place, junior division. KC and Athena are best friends. KC is the best therapy horse anyone could ever be around, Athena says, and she is beautiful. Thank you for bringing her out to the parade. Here we have Representative Jim Thompson. He's our state representative for House District 23. He takes good care of us, and he represents parts of Polk County, Yamhill, Benton, Lynn, and Marion. Thanks, Jim, for being with us. And there's Helga. She's the cruiser woman there. Got her pirate outfit on, I know. I see All right. both gyms, the gym and the gym. Hey, guys, thanks. And here we have Faith Christian School. Faith Christian School has been part of the Dallas community for the past 27 years. This school offers preschool through eighth grade. After all these years, we're still strong, still family, and still a great choice for your child. Glad to have you with us, Family Christian School. All right. Thanks for being with us, guys. All right. Ahoy! It's Oregon First Community Credit Union's float this year is all about protecting your personal treasures with the wide variety of products and services that they provide. From safe deposit boxes to sound financial decision making, Oregon First is committed to exceeding their members' expectations with Oregon First difference. They're located next to Walmart on Ellendale if you haven't seen them. They are a proud Summerfest sponsor this year. They are also a pirate ship Grungy Galleon crew sponsor. Again, we couldn't have built our ship without your guys' support and sponsorship. We thank you for it. Following them is George Van Dyke Trucking. This big rig is being driven by Neil Reed from Tangent. He hauls lumber, roofing products, Pepsi, and any other items that could be hauled in a curtain van. It's a gorgeous truck. Thanks for being with us. To another five years, come dance with us. Give a wave to Step Up Choa on there, dance teacher. So good to see you guys in the parade. And here we have World Gym. World Gym's been in Dallas for 14 years, and they would like to have you all help us treasure those who give back to the Dallas community. Remember, they're offering Zumba, yoga, Pilates, child care, and tanning. Nominate someone who deserves recognition for free membership. Check in at World Gym, which is just right across the street here at the front desk. Thanks, guys, for being part of our community for all these years. Thank you. They also have Tantasy Island, the rock climbing wall, and they are a proud sponsor of our pirate coloring mural this year. We want you to join them any Sunday morning at 9.30 a.m. for contemporary worship. They have 
programs and events for all ages and are represented here with their team band. Free classes as well as 24 hour access to all of their club members. 
If you want more information about the club, they have the huge roof on the corner lawn right across from the pirate ship. Stop by and take a look. Larry Wilson is driving a 1935 Chevy four-door master touring car that won first place with antique collector special interest cars. Nice. Nancy's in Hi there too. Out there. All right, guys. Thank you. This has double suicide doors, torch red paint. Lots of fun trips are planned. It's a beautiful vehicle. We appreciate you driving it in our parade. I know that. Behind them is another trophy or a ribbon winner this year. Third place for the 1927 T Roadster from Ron Lake. Five-speed manual transmission. The car has its original steel frame, no fiberglass. The car even has the original California license plate. All right. We won't hold it against you being in Dallas for the parade. <laughs> <laughs> and behind them, we have the Farmers Insurance Ride Team. This. Uh, vehicle owned by Steve Erickson from Vancouver, Washington is a 1963 Pontiac Grand Prix 421 cubic engine engine, five years of total work, and it's the uh, national Pontiac champ for four, four years ago. Thank you for being here. Here we have the Dallas High School Athletics Group, which is representing our athletic programs at Dallas High School. Please come out and support your Dallas Dragon athletes this year. The two-seated dragon carts being driven by our own athletic director, Tim Larson, and they received a ribbon for third place in marching groups. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. They promoted Dallas and the Dragons by being in the Rose Parade this year. They did a beautiful job. I saw pictures. I saw sunburns. We appreciate you girls being out there. guys, thank you. Alright, well done Dragon Ladies. Okay folks, it's time for the huge round of applause because here is our best in show grand trophy winners for our parade this year, the Sea Dragon. Monkey Island, a group of dancers and crew. Captain Drake of the C 
sea dragon and Princess Zariah at the wheel. Monkey Island overflows with bountiful treasures, followed by a crew of old hags, scallywags, wenches, and gypsy dancers. That is impressive, folks. Thank you very much for getting into Summerfest and our theme of the RV Pirates this year and bringing out your sea dragon and a sea baby through the whole thing. <laughs> and here we have our own Forest River Inc. The truck is being provided by Hayward Ford and is towing a 2011 Wildwood XLT, which was built right here at Forest River. Great employer, great supporter in the community. We appreciate everything that they do. Behind this cruise light is a Salem, Salem cruise light with a truck provided by McGowan Chevrolet towing a 2011 Salem 18 LT cruise, again by Forrester. Christian Academy, a private Christian school, preschool through 12th grade, located in Monmouth. Color Guard team presented here is looking for girls in grades 7 through 12 to participate in the upcoming year. Thanks for being here, guys. We appreciate you guys coming out. They are a school dedicated to building Christian values and academic growth. Debbie von Blumenstein in spoils that I can't believe you walked through this whole parade with them. Oh! <laughs> Attorney Debbie is a sassy wench who will have your legal troubles walking the plane. She has a treasure chest of trial experience with 13 years of private practice throughout Northwest Oregon. Check out her website at DebbieVonBlumenstein.com. She is a chamber member, so if you can't quite remember how to spell that name, go ahead and visit the chamber website. You'll find her there. And we want to thank the Polk County Marine Patrol for being part of our parade this week. The Polk County Sheriff's Office Marine Patrol Unit is a specialized unit within the Sheriff's Office that provides law enforcement and water rescue service on the Willamette River. The Sheriff's Office conducts daily patrols on that 40-mile stretch of the Willamette and has been chosen as the Marine Patrol Unit of the Year both in 2001, 4, 6, 8, and again in 2009 by the Oregon State Marine Board. Search and rescue folks, give them a hand! The Sheriff's Office, thank you. with us and all that you do and yeah. your volunteer giving. Absolutely. Yeah. Sheriff's Office here featuring their incident response. Truck and trailer. You hope you never have to call, but when you do, Polk County is the best. Alright, thanks to the SALT for being part of the rescue and for the sheriff's work that they provide. Papa Murphy's taking baked pizza. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Make sure you stop by our very own Papa Murphy's on Ellendale. Order your pizza ahead of time. We have the Trail of Tears. It's a haunted house that's used to raise food and money for our community. This is the fourth, nice guys, fourth and final year of this event. Every year this haunted house has earned hundreds of dollars and tons of food for Dallas's food banks. Please come this year and support Trail of Tears dead end and bring your canned food money to H and to help H2O be prepared to be scared. Right here in Dallas, celebrating 20 years. My 
Mike, Susan, Mike, thank Susan. you so much for being a part of our community. ME provides residential Woo! and commercial wiring, service work, remodels, repairs, new construction, and 24-hour emergency service. Customer service is their number one goal, and troubleshooting is their specialty. We appreciate their support as okay. chamber members and as summer festivals. Next up is Tycor Tylo. They won second place ribbon for miscellaneous vehicles. All right, guys. Tycor Title began operations in 1893 with the goal of providing the highest level of customer service. And next we have the 12 Visions Party. Discover the 12 Visions Party, the non-ruling class unifier. In to rule of man to launch the rule of mankind, making all the people rich, including the poor. Thank you for being with us. Perry Rattler Construction has been building custom homes in our community since 1983. Proud to have you in our community and as uh, being in our parade. We also have Dallas Glass Window. Thanks, guys. We appreciate you guys coming out. Good supporters of our community. Thank you. We appreciate you coming out for the 2010 Summer Fest Parade. What do you get when you cross a pie and a rat? A, a pirate! pirate.